Well, we're back in the low rent district of Franklin, Tennessee at Kiwi's Cream Puff Crematorium for part three of our 427 Cobra saga. Saga. Yeah, saga. Yeah, cool yeah. 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 So we came out two days ago, just check out the car and everything, and it was just, it was dumping fuel. It was horrible. Yeah, it wasn't it was right, right. really bad. It wasn't happening. So I snatched one of the carburetors, brought it back to the shop, went through it. And that's a video we posted yesterday, and if you didn't see it, Uncle Kathy will put a link to it someplace. She does that. She puts the she links. She does that. Yeah. yeah. She does all the important stuff. There. She does do all the important stuff. <laughs> and uh, now, if you remember the last time we were here, I was I did a little dumpster diving because Kiwi has some really cool stuff he just throws away because money means nothing to him. But I was visited by the angel of death, and he said, Bring, oh, bring Kiwi back. back his... I don't know how they got in the trash. I don't know. Yeah. Oh. But there they are. There they are. They're actually off this, so that's yeah. handy to have. Yeah. So it's, it's off my conscience now. Not that I really have one, but if I did, I would feel did, better. Did little that. Kiwi come to you in your dreams? Did he tell, the angel tell you death. you had to do the I right had thing. a really long nose. <laughs> okay, got really <laughs> So, I brought the car back here last night. You bolted on the car. Yep. And okay, um, well, yeah, we put it on, and like you said, didn't adjust it, didn't touch it, just just fired her up. Yep. And we also put new plugs in it again because they they had washed the plug. Yeah. They were new plugs anyway, but they'd washed them out. And plugs these days, once they've washed out, they don't, just don't seem to they go. They don't again. make spark plugs like they used to. No, no, they don't, and it seems a waste to throw away because they're like twelve dollar plugs. Yeah. Um, but we put a new set of plugs in, and it fired up, and you could tell straight away it's back on eight cylinders. Yeah. Um, it um, smoked a little bit for a couple of minutes, just clearing out the old unburnt shit that had all built up in the mufflers and stuff. And it's running like a charm now. Now, the back carburetor the also back needed carburetor. to... Yeah, I, I, I just took the back bowl off it and the metering block off, and that had that blank... It had those blank blank blanks also. Um, yeah, and I've seen those little blanks before, but they're usually on the secondaries on, like, a 780 or something like that that doesn't need a metering block. Well, they were, they were uh, trying to fix... The problem. Yeah, trying to reduce the fuel, but yeah. the, it was overfueling at the bottom end, not the top end. They killed the fuel at the top end. So, well, this thing, see, it's only got like 60s in it in the primary, well, on both carburetors. It's only got like 60s in the main jets. And to my way of thinking, an all aluminum 427 needs a little bit more fuel than that, but we're not really here to do a tune up, tune up on it, but to get the car running. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so yeah, let's fire this thing up. So most people you can't really hear yourself think, but it's you can. <laughs> yeah, but it's it's the right volume, if you ask me. Well, there you go. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you're, you're three quarters deaf anyway. From this the is true. Day, this so. is true. Yeah. That thing hurts my ear. Really? A little bit. Yeah. It's soft. Uh, they don't make them like Kiwis like they make Americans. This is this is true. All right. So like I said, most people never get to experience no. what a ride in one of these things is like. Yeah. It's yeah. So let's do right. this thing. Okay. Kathy come for a ride? No, I'm not going to get in that. <laughs> yeah, Uncle I Kathy. Did, will... I did figure out a technique to driving it, and that is you've got to take your shoes off. Ah. You've got to drive in socks. Um, <laughs> that way you can at least. Feet, man. Well, I do have big flippers, but hey, you know. Yeah. Oh, shit. You know, say what people with big feet, though. Don't wow. They? Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, come on, let's get, let's get Kathy in this thing. Right. You nervous, Kathy? No. No? Okay. Let's see if we can fix it. <laughs> if I was going to steal something, it wouldn't be my workshop shoe.
the head throttle. It's always nice when the road test goes off without a hitch. It is. It is. It's good. All right. The only thing yeah. I noticed is you were pulling out. Yeah. The front wheels are a little. Yeah. There's uh, driving it down the road. It, it's very twitchy. nervous. Very twitchy. It wants to follow the road. Yeah. You know, any bumps or tracks in the road. So we're going to throw it back up in the air and have a look, a closer look at that front suspension and see. Just make sure everything's. I mean, all we've been really focusing on is the motor and transmission, right? Uh, and brakes on it. So it's time to have a look at that suspension and make sure everything's. Yeah, uh, well, as, as it you're pulling out, the back, the front wheels are out like a little bit. Right. Maybe it's just an adjustment. Or... Yeah, it might just be as simple as the wheel liner, but like I've said in the earlier videos, it's a fairly old kit car. Right. Um, so you know, it's all it's all been working for quite some time. So. You know, to the, say there's not bushes gone or the thing with something like this, I mean, obviously you can't take any chances with short wheelbase, lightweight car like this with all that power. It doesn't take much to put this thing in a ditch. So no, obviously, no. You got to take care of it, so. Yeah, it'll bite you. It won't, I mean, it's 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 an angry machine. Yeah. It. Uh, it How'd you like the ride? Guys? It wants to hurt you. It was awesome. It was awesome. Mm -hmm. We didn't get too carried away. No, it just didn't feel good. Yeah, I, I'm mm. sure. Yeah. Oh, that roll bar really wouldn't do very much, would it? If you're really short, it would help. Yeah, and well strapped in. Well, it would Other protect your shoulders, like, yeah. like all your yeah. head was ground off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's ground off. Ooh, it's not a pretty thought, is it? All right, well, man, thanks for sharing the, the uh, Cobra experience with us. No worries. And uh, we'll see you for the next adventure. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go dive through your garbage and see what I can find. Hey, man. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. See you, guys. Oh, I, I, I forgot to say, make sure you sub to Kiwi's Crack Ups and Croutons. <laughs> Kiwi Classics and Customs is what he actually means. Kiwi's Classics and Customs. Okay, that's it. Now we can go. There's nothing. You, you got rid of the garbage. We well, have to the cans this morning, man. See you tomorrow.